Hey everyone, after three days of searching, I finally found a fix for the not launching, stuck on splash screen issue in Assassin's Creed Valhalla on Windows 10. Most YouTube guides only work for Windows 11 and none of them helped me. But don't worry, this guide is made for Windows 10 and I hope it works for you. Step one. Close background apps like MSI Afterburner, Pack Control, and similar apps if you're using them because they can interfere with the game or cause crashes. Step two, set high performance mode to ensure the game uses your GPU because it forces the game to run on your dedicated GPU. Step three, run the game as administrator because it gives the game the necessary permissions to start properly. Step four, most important, Use Process Lasso to allow the game to use all CPU cores. Because Assassin's Creed Valhalla's engine may be designed to distribute workloads across multiple CPU cores. However, for some reason, Windows 10 or your PC might not allocate enough cores, causing the game to fail to launch properly. Setting it to use all available cores ensures a smooth startup. Follow these steps to fix it. Step one, download Process Lasso, a tool for managing CPU core usage and optimizing performance. The reason you need Process Lasso is that the game's launcher closes too quickly. Even if you try to set the CPU cores for the game using Task Manager, it won't save the settings and the launcher shuts down too fast, so you don't have enough time to adjust it manually. Step two, create a rule for the Assassin's Creed Valhalla.exe process. Step three, Tick all available CPU cores on your system and enjoy the game. Select options. CPU. CPU affinities. Copy the exact name of the .exe file from the game installation folder. For my system, which has 24 CPU cores, I enable all of them. Do the same for your system by selecting all available CPU cores. Click OK. Add rule. OK. After that, run the game and see if it works. Important note, if your game is installed on drive D, E, or any drive other than C, and the fix still doesn't work, the game might need to run from drive C. If that's the case, follow the tutorial linked in the video description below. It's quick and easy, but first, make sure to follow my guide and test the game before trying the next solution. Thanks for watching.